Hey there and welcome. We're going to look quickly at how to make neat shapes like this one that I used to make when I was a kid with a spirograph. I don't know if you ever had a spirograph. I won't explain it to you. You can Google it if you want to. But now I can make these neat shapes with Adobe Illustrator and so can you if you have Adobe Illustrator. All you need to do is simply take a tool such as your pen tool, your line tool, your shape tool, or your brush tool and make a shape. I'm just going to use the brush tool and I'm going to just draw some random shape. Okay, there's my shape. Oh boy, I'm going to have to select my shape and put my stroke to uh, just a regular stroke. I'm going to bump this up here. Okay, so I've got some random shape. Next, after you get your shape, whatever shape you want, take your rotate tool select it excuse me select to make sure your shape selected select your rotate tool you will see in the very center of your shape a blue crosshair I like to move my blue crosshair so it's at the corner somewhere at a corner so I'm gonna move mine down here way down here I'm gonna hold down alt and when I do my crosshair has an ellipses come up on it do you see that there the ellipses Okay, so I'm going to ellipses with Alt and then click. That's telling me it's going to give me more information. And then I'm going to rotate my object and I'm going to rotate it 12 degrees because that's a number that is uh, easily multiplied into 360 degrees because I want a 360 degree shape. Instead of hitting OK, I'm going to hit Copy and what that will do is it'll make a copy that is rotated at 12 degrees. There we go. Now, the easy part, if you hold down control on, on, a, on a PC and then you tap D, it's going to do the same thing again, 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 until I get all the way around back to where I started. And there we go, a shape, just like that. I'm going to make sure that I select the whole thing, move it up so we can take a nice look at it. There it is, a shape. You can do that. Follow these steps with any sort of shape you want and you will have yourself a spiral graph type design.